good morning to all i suggested my students to write the address of the program on their own starting from their register number and also the op code for each mnemonics so that they can uh, they can have the practice of uh, finding out what is the, whether the instruction is a two byte instruction or three byte instruction they will really understand what is the meaning of uh, two byte three byte or one byte instruction okay let us assume a student is having a register number of 0025 so let us say that is the initial address of the program and uh, here op code so we have an op code for move immediate d and we have got the second data can be written here directly 00h so what is the op code for mvid how do we know only from the op code sheet so 8085 is providing an op code sheet so which is uh, giving us mvid so mvid means 16 there is a op code is 16 so here we have to write 16h so the next address here is 0026h similarly here 0027h so what is the op code for lhld so lhld there is an op code so we have to go back to the instruction sheet and find out where is the lhld and h i j k l and hijk okay so we have lhld address has to be mentioned it is 2a op code is 2a so you just simply type 2 a h here and then this address is there no this address has to be written as lsv of the address first and then msv of the address that is 20 h and then we have to mention the address as 28 h and uh, 0029H. And now we have to write the next address 00. 29 means after 29 it is 2A. So move A comma L. So what is move A comma L? Move A is there. Move A comma L is here. So this is 7D. So the op code is 7D. So the next address is 002B and add h add h you can see you can find out the op code from the sheet add h is nothing but 84 so add h is 84 h so always use h so that you can understand see now it is an important uh, point comes here jump no carry next what is next next is labeled here so we should know what is the address here so here the address is 002C and it is 002D, it is 002E and here comes 002F and then 0030. So 0030 is the address of the instruction that is labeled next. Hmm. So which means that while writing the op code, so we have to find out what is the op code for J and C, jump no carry. So jump no carry, we can find out jump no carry. Yes, it is D2. What it is? It is D2H. Now the next, the address of the next we have to mention here. Because the microprocessor will not understand any label, even the mnemonics it will not understand. It will understand only the hexadecimal code. So the address has to be written like LSP first, which is 00H, sorry, 00, I mean 30 is the LSP. Now the MSP is 00H actually. So now INRD, what is the op code for INRD? INRD is 14, it is 14H. And then STA. STA is there for STA. What is the op code? Find out STA address that is 32. So this is 32 H and then this is uh, 0031, then 0032, and then 0033. 
So mu a comma d. We have to go here and find out what is mu a comma d. Mu a comma d is a seven a. This is seven a. So here we have forgotten. So what is st a? Two zero zero two. So LSP is zero two, and then it is two zero. H. And again STA, so STA we saw that it is 32H, so therefore it is uh, 32H and it is 0, 3 is the LSP, that is uh, 0, 3H is the LSP and 2, 0 is the MSP. So address, it is 33 here, it is uh, 0, 0, 3, 4 and 0, 0, 3, 5. 0, 0, 0036 and then the next one is 0, 0, 0037 so there is an opcode for halt we'll find out what is the opcode for halt hlt it is 76 so we just type 76 h so why the opcodes are very important you know the opcodes are the real a binary number in which the microprocessor can understand the processor works with the binaries only ones and zeros this opcodes equivalent this opcode is written in hexadecimal its equivalent binary code will be generated and only the binary code is entered inside the processor or inside the memory locations and uh, microprocessor access this code from the memory location and operates or perform the internal operation based on the memory, I mean based on the binary values only. So we should understand this address, therefore how the address is written because uh, here it is not a next, next cannot be understood by the microprocessor only 0030 can be understood, 0030. For our understanding only we are writing the label. We are writing the program in assembly language program. But for microprocessor, understand only the binary number. The two, we are writing that binary into hexadecimal number. So thanks for watching this video. Uh, keep connected with me for uh, more such videos. Whatever doubts you have, you can ask me in the comment box. Thanks for watching.